Hey everyone, this is Andrea back with Breaking Bad Season 1, Episode 6. I cannot believe we are already almost at the end of this season. It's been definitely a crazy ride and I'm all here for it. In the last episode we saw, we found out a little bit about Walt's backstory with Grey Matter. We met Gretchen and Elliot and found out that Walt used to have a relationship with Gretchen. I, we still don't know what happened to end Walt's involvement in Grey Matter. I hope we find out more in subsequent episodes. We also saw Walt, Walter and his family argue about chemotherapy and despite Gretchen offering assistance, Walter refused her assistance. So he definitely seems really stubborn in that regards. He, I feel like Walt wants to do what he wants to do and doesn't necessarily want to take the advice of others. So we will see what happens. Let's get right to it. But before we do that, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so please drop a comment I would love to hear from you and we also have a patreon which offers you access to full uncut episodes well in advance of the YouTube upload well that looks like a disaster in there okay so it looks like they're working together again <laughs> This, the chemistry, is my realm. I am in charge of the cooking. This operation is you and me, and I'm the silent partner. Wow, Walt is so demanding here. My goodness. No more bloodshed. No. So this is a flash forward. Oh my gosh. What did Walt do here? Wow, okay, so I guess we're gonna find out something huge happened. I have no idea what, but hopefully we find out in this episode. So it looks like he's undergoing chemotherapy. Hmm. You know, honey, you, you really don't have to. Look, I like being here with you. Looks like Skylar's a little bit more supportive in this. Have you been in touch with Elliot? Uh oh, because, uh, <laughs> I haven't seen a check from him. Oh no! Yes, I, I got it. <laughs> oh my God, Walter, stop lying. <laughs> I'm taking care of it. Good. Mm -hmm. Oh no. So we're good. We're good. Could you not deposit this until Monday? Chemical reactions involve change on two levels: matter. And energy. He still got his job. <clears throat> Generates enormous bursts of energy. Uh, uh, oh. Who can... Like an explosion? <laughs> <laughs> Explosions are the result of chemical reactions. The faster they undergo change, the more violent the explosion. I wonder if this is foreshadowing for what happens later in the episode. Doesn't look like he's focused. Oh! Oof. Oh yeah. The chemotherapy. Oh. He's starting to lose weight, which is um, tough to see that. Oh. And when you don't tell me what's going on, I mean, it's like, I feel like you don't even want me around sometimes. Well, he is lying to her about some things or keeping some things from her. Walt, is there anything else you're holding back from your family? <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> oh, geez. Mm. I'm cooking meth. Well, <laughs> it's just that sometimes it feels better not to talk at all. I think Skylar struggles to understand that. Maybe knowing what you do when you're alone. <laughs> Look at Skylar's face. <laughs> I, I like to go on walks. Skylar does not look convinced. It's really very therapeutic. <laughs> so much irony in this. Oh. 
Oof. Yo, guy, you okay? Oh, oh. Sit down, get some air. Oh, God. Yeah? Well, it is the middle of the desert, so I'd be pretty hot, too. Cancer. You got it, right? Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Did you know? Aunt had one of those dots on her. What is it, in your lung? I'm your partner, man. You should have told me. That is true. What stage are you? 3A. On your lip notes. Your aunt. How, how bad was she when they caught it? How long? Seven months. Oof, that's not long. That's why you're doing all this. Mm hmm. You want to make some cash for your people before you check out. Oh, Jesse. You could put it in nicer terms. You gonna be able to finish the batch? Yes. No. No, oh, no. You do it. Oh, Jesse, he looks so confused. What happened to your mad skills? That's going to mess up the batch if Jesse has to do it. You can do it. I wonder how Jesse's going to figure out what to do or if the batch is going to be corrupted. Is that when we find way out in the boonies, that cook site? Lab says they pulled up an imprint of some old writing used to be on the inside, an old magic marker or something. Property of J.P. Wynn Chemistry Lab. That's Walt School. Oh, jeez! Oh, God! Oof. It's kind of scary. I mean, I, I, he's not going to think of Walt, but still. He's getting closer to the truth. <laughs> so Jesse had to finish the batch and do the do the street work. Must be challenging to have to be so subtle in public places like that. Hey, I'm out there making fat stacks, man. Chill. <laughs> Prepaid cell phone. Use it. Oh, those are definitely fat 26 stacks. Twenty-six big ones. Twenty-six thousand dollars. Twenty-six hundred, and your share is thirteen. Mm -hmm. How much meth did you sell? Nearly an ounce. There were sixteen ounces to a pound. What'd you do with the rest? Smoke it. Why don't you just did he screw up the rest the of the pound at once? <laughs> to who? What do I look like, Scarface? <laughs> this, this return is too little for the risk. I thought you'd be ready for another pound. You may know a lot about chemistry, man, but you don't know jack about slinging dope. <laughs> uh, we have to move our product in bulk, wholesale now. How do we do that? What do you mean, to like a distributor? Yes. Yes! That's what we need. We need a distributor now. Do you know anyone like that? I used to, until you killed him. <laughs> they didn't use a distributor, distributor before. Took Crazy Eight's place. Some guy named Tuco. Tuco, okay, so then just go talk to Tuco. But would you be interested in a felony quantity of methamphetamine? <laughs> And he's not gonna do business with some dude he doesn't know. I mean, we're making money. Why can't you just be satisfied with the way oh, it is? Oh, well. Just throw some fucking balls! Oh my god. Oh yeah, this partnership's not gonna last long. <gasps> oh. Now Walt's balancing or trying to balance the checkbook behind Skylar's back. Mm, this guy's gonna think something's going on. The janitor? Mm. The janitor's maybe gonna tell the principal that something's going on with Walt. I don't think he's long for his job. Uh-oh. Oh, hey. How are you feeling, Walt? Good. Yeah. Mm, another lie. Are you up for having a visitor? Hey, buddy. Oh, Hank. <laughs> Chick's got an ass like an onion. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Hank. <laughs> oh, jeez. Do you recognize that? Oh, he does. Oh? Hmm. Well, that was used to cook meth. Oh, the label on the inside used to say J.P. Wynn Chemistry Lab. 
Really? Well, I was hoping you could help me with that. <laughs> uh, we found it near an abandoned car. It belonged to one of our snitches. A snitch? Yeah, one of our confidential informants. Anyway, you, uh, any respirators like that go missing lately? <clears throat> no, no. I'll need to take a look at that inventory. Sure. He's going to find all the other missing things. Are there any other respirators? Because I'm counting six. Uh, inventory says eight. Mm. Glassware looking a little sparse. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> 5,000 milliliter round bottom. Methods love to ruin this baby. Just. No, I don't. Well, maybe it's Scarlett. She's in trouble or something. I mean, shit. Don't it's probably Jesse. Answer it. Come on. I got stuff to do. <laughs> Jesse saying he found a distributor. That's my guess. Yo, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> and Hank's there too. Hey, so, you know that guy we were talking about, mm. Tuco? Turns out my boy Skinny Pete was in the same cell block. So we got her in. We're hauling a pound to the dude right now. <laughs> okay then, well. Yo, know, look buddy, the last thing I want to do is get you in hot water. Right. But some meth monkey had a feeding frenzy in here. We don't want people to start wondering about you. Right? Oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> so you sure you're tight with this guy? Two nuts in a ball sack, yo. <laughs> Maybe this isn't such a good idea, yo. Come on. Okay, he does remember him. Yeah, man. I'm surprised they let Jesse in if he doesn't know who Jesse is. This guy's gonna be scary. Tuco, what's happening, my brother? Yeah, Jesse do with the glass I was telling you about. I wonder how much that bag's worth. Take a walk. No worries, man. I'm no cough. I said hit it. Yeah, if he tells you to take a bump, you take a bump. Or you'll take a different kind of bump. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Booyah! Wow! <laughs> wow, okay, I guess it passes the test. I cooked it. <laughs> mm. Bullshit. Yeah, that is bullshit. Who are you working for? Oh, and man, I mean, I have a partner that I cook with, but that's it. We got a deal. I haven't said how much. <sighs> <sighs> All right. How much? 35 large for the pound. Whoa, you little lightest. Oh yeah, because you use some. <laughs> what about the money? You get it. This is consignment operation. You want me to float 35 G's? You don't trust me? Mm. I wouldn't. I don't do business yeah, that way. I don't oh, blame shit, you. The deal is done. He's just gonna take his drugs and don't front, dude. Tuco's good for it. Oh, I don't need your punk ass to vote for me! Oh, he's gonna kick them both out now. Come on! Oh, oh, come oh on. Jesse, you're breaking the deal. Oh, Jesse's in trouble here. Do you really want your money in front? Uh, well, I think that's fair. Or at least give him half. I think half would be fair. Up front. Does it counterfeit? Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Oh, Jesse! Oh! Oh my god! Nobody moves crystal in the South Valley but me, bitch! Oh. Here you go. Oh. Is he a suspect? Is that Uncle Hank? What? Why are they arresting him? I got two words for you. Background check. How about that? And they're getting a substitute for a few weeks. Oh. I, I just didn't have a chance to tell you. Sorry. Skylar doesn't like not to be informed about everything. Why were you arresting Mr. Archuleta the other day? Well, uh, turns out he has a record. Yeah. A couple of possession beefs. We figured he was the guy that was stealing your uh, your school's chemistry gear. Mm, Hank, don't make assumptions. And when we searched his truck, we found a big old fat blunt. I mean, for what it's worth, I, 
Hugo just doesn't strike me as a thief. <laughs> Another personal, Walt, but uh, you wouldn't know a criminal if he was close enough to check you for a hernia. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, but he didn't read your chemistry set. You hiding something? <laughs> <laughs> Is he talking about poker or real life here? <laughs> Just like it's you and me, buddy. You gonna man up or are you gonna puss out? <laughs> Hank. Hank is your generic alpha male. I'm all in. <laughs> there is so much irony going on here. This poker game is like an allegory for of it, real buddy, life. Fold. Oh my god, you threw away an ace? I bet Walt's cards were garbage. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Hank looks pissed. <laughs> Maybe Hank's not as smart as he says he is. Oh. Oh no. Shoot. Oh. Oh my gosh. I was all like, damn, Tuco, chill, I say. I don't know what got into him. Seriously. So you're the cook, huh? Yo, I didn't catch your name. Is he going to tell him his real name? Or is he going to make something up? Tell me about this, Tuco. Oh, he's gonna shave his head. Oh, wow. Oh, no, I wonder what Skylar's... Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Okay, he looks like a completely different guy. Oh, my gosh. Yes, I agree with Skylar. Badass, Dad. <laughs> yes, he does. He looks way tougher and... Yeah. He does look tough now. He fits the cooking role a lot more. Oh my gosh, I am so scared for Walt here. Oh my goodness. What's your name? Heisenberg. Heisenberg? Heisenberg. Okay, he's got a code name. I don't imagine I'll be here very long. Wow, Walt's got some balls. <laughs> Why don't you start talking and tell me what you want? Fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> Thirty-five for the pound of Matthew. Stoller, yeah, no kidding. And another fifteen for my partner's pain and suffering. All right. Wow. <laughs> I don't know how Tuco's going to handle that, but those are some demands. Oh, he just put a cigarette out on his tongue. Oh my God. I steal your dope. Hmm? I break the piss. Out of your mule boy. And then you walk in here and you bring me more men? <laughs> I hope boy, I hope he does have a plan. One part of that wrong. This is not meth. What? What is it? Oh shit! Holy god! Holy shit! Oh my god! Are you fucking nuts? You wanna find out? I give you your money. Let's say you bring me another pound next week. Money up front. Yeah. All right. Money up front. One pound is not gonna cut it. You have to take two. Hey. What is that shit? Fulminated mercury. Mm, yes, from the chemistry lesson. I figured that was foreshadowing of some sorts. <laughs> Tuco just got a chemistry lesson. <laughs> wow, okay. I wonder where he got the name Heisenberg. Well, it looks like his transformation is complete. He was Walt, now he's Heisenberg. That's his badass name. Is it counterfeit? Oh geez, he better get out of there. Wow, that took balls. I can't believe he did that. That is not the same Walt from the beginning of the season. <laughs> 
Wow, okay. Um, so that was an absolutely insane episode. I did not expect Walt to walk in there and blow up their blow up the joint, so to speak. Um, so it looks like he got paid. I'm not sure if that's counterfeit money. I guess um, that looks like that was why Walt got mad that maybe Tuco gave him counterfeit money. I have no idea. I guess we'll find out next episode. But it looks like his transformation is well underway. He's he, he was Walt White, the mild-mannered chemistry teacher. He's now Heisenberg, the uh, the cook. <laughs> So that is just, wow, I don't have words for that episode. That was crazy. It looks like Jesse's still in the hospital. Hopefully, it looks like he, I'm sure he'll recover. Um, I'm not too, too worried about him, but he definitely got a beating from Tuco and his, his friends there. So it looks like maybe... I'm guessing that in the next episode, Jesse will be back with Walt and they will be working together again. I'm a little worried about Hank now. Maybe Hank has found out more than he should. I kind of feel bad for the janitor because other than, I guess, a past minor criminal record, he didn't really do anything wrong. And it looks like uh, Walt is still keeping secrets from Skylar. I wonder if or when Skylar finds out and Hank seems to kind of be coming a little bit closer finding the goggles from the chemistry lab and all the missing equipment so I wonder uh, looks like Hank is obviously going to be continuing his search for whoever actually did uh, rob the chemistry lab so next time you see me I will be reacting to episode 7 the finale I cannot wait so I'll see you guys next time